this is my guitar. It's pink. These are the electronics that I use, the, the beginning of the electronics for sampling. And I actually have something that I made during the first pass of the most recent piece of music, which started life like this. So this is a sample of my guitar, modified, and we've been using it in the piece. And I control it with my feet and my hands at the same time. A lot happens in here. So I can turn it off there. I can turn it on. I can decide here how much reverb is on it. I can control the level of the reverb here. No space. So here's no space. And here's all space. Same sound, all space. No space. Pitch. Again, that's a guitar, over, an overdubbed guitar. Unlike the, the, the method of looping that you see somebody like Ted Sheeran do, this is an old form of looping, but, but nothing. It's old. Um, here's the guitar. This is a volume pedal. These are some more sampling pedals down here. This is not a sampling pedal. It makes me go whammy. This is a little sampler down here, which uh, so that's what that does. This does the same thing except differently, but it's got something in it already, so I won't fuck with it. So that's something that I recorded while we were actually doing the piece of music, and it's a piece, it's just two notes from a melody of Stefan's that I wanted to relate back to the piece that we're playing in. These are more pedals that make bad noises, bad, bad fuzz. <laughs> Yeah, that's like a... So, it's kind of a sort of Nintendo type sound with reverb on it. Um, here's another one. It's in case we do any black metal material at all. This is a bar that makes pitches different.
And then there are the important amplifiers in the back. The little guy, which is owned by the studio, is a little amp there. The little silver thing is owned by me, which is the main amp sound. A couple pedals there and another amp, and that's the whole rig. Woo! <laughs> That'd be it. That'd be it, dude. So look face, everyone. <laughs>